Yeah, again, the market's been yeah quite uh, quite uh, bullish recently, so the market's gone up and valuations uh, um, have gone up along with that as uh, as interest rates uh, continue to come down. That's affecting uh, term deposits, so people are out there as their term deposits are maturing, looking for a higher income. So to get that higher income, they've got to look at either you know the share market, look at some of the bank stocks, which provide a very healthy um, dividend, which provides franking credits as well, uh, or they may be looking at property, whichever their preferences are. So that's something that uh, I know a lot of people are doing, but uh, when they do that, as they chase a higher income, a higher income return via yield, that also pushes the prices up of these assets, and that's where you know, we're not hell-bent on doing too much buying at the moment. But we're always out there looking for um, very good companies that have got no debt and are well run, um, that are in sectors that have got scale. And what I mean by scale is that they can continue to um, you know, sell their products without uh, you know, expending too much money in capital to, uh, to get those extra, extra sales. So companies like uh, Infomedia, um, which are in software, um, CSL, which is pharmaceuticals, obviously there's a huge amount of capital to, uh, in research and development, but once they get there with their products, then uh, they're very scalable. The other thing we're doing at the moment as uh, our clients' uh, term deposits might be coming due, uh, it was only about three months ago, a five-year term deposit was going to give us 4%. Um, and I told those people at the time that while 4% is not great, in the future it may look really good. Now, we're only three or four months down the track and that 4% over for a five-year term deposit does look great. We're now getting around 3, 3.1, 3.2 for a five-year term deposit. So what we're doing there, we're starting to look at some of the hybrid securities uh, that provide clients uh, sometimes a fully frank uh, yield of around 5 to 6%. Now, with the hybrid securities, uh, there are more risk than a term deposit, but there is also, you know, mixed in with other cash investments, they can still form part of the conservative side of the portfolio. So that's what we're doing at the moment. Um, yeah, hope that's a help, and I'll see you next time. Ta.